have, didn't you manage to use throw grenades when you were in a basic? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, actually, I don't know if I've told you guys about that, no, but, you didn't. um... <laughs> I'd, like to, I'd like to know. Yeah, that's it's, awesome. It's beautiful. So... <laughs> Basically, um, we, we, we made a whole day out of it, because that's pretty much what you do in BASIC. And, um, they had a system, because it, it wasn't the actual drill sergeants that were teaching us, uh, this particular, uh, uh, uh this particular aspect of soldiering. I will say that. My name's Gunner, too! Er anyway, oh, <laughs> er they had, uh, er they had their own staff there. Uh, something, you know, they called them cadre, but, you know, just like, uh, people who worked on base, who all they did was teach grenade stuff. And, they had, uh, they had these dummy grenades, and they threw it, like, right next to the audience, and it went off, and everybody freaked out, and it was all funny. But, there, there are certain things that you're not supposed to do when you're throwing grenades. There's certain very, um, you know, very apparent flaws, you know, you have to, obviously you have to throw it far enough away from you so that it doesn't kill you, right? You have to. <clears throat> you you have to duck when you throw a grenade. You can't just watch it go off. You have to go. You know, here's a little demonstration. Like, oh wow, look a grenade. No oh, duck. So then when the shrapnel goes off, yep. it won't hit you in the fucking face. Yep. You know, uh, I forget. There are like three or four different problems. And it, so when we were going through the course, uh, we had, we had to wear. You know, we had our, the whole battle, the full battle rattle. Yeah. It, which included the ACH, which uh, it, you know translated is basically the helmet, the, the Kevlar. And <laughs> to, to basically speed things along, and uh, so that so that they knew who was doing what, you know, who was doing what wrong, uh, who was doing what wrong, basically. I, I can't English today. They would uh, put a mark on your on your helmet with chalk. Oh. So by the end of uh, all those practice runs, mine looked like a fucking coloring book. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, that was humiliating, and I had to walk all the way up the hill. To, uh, but everybody did. Everybody had to walk all the way up the hill to uh, the actual real big boy grenade range. You know, and the drill sergeants were there watching you, and you coop up in this tiny, tiny little bunker. Like, I'm talking, and it felt tinier because you ba you're you basically, like, face to ass, like, oh, nice textures there, chief. F you know, face to ass, just really close to each other in, like, yeah. this conveyor belt line. You know, you get in, and you just slowly make your way through. Yeah, imagine, like, Disneyland. But somebody like shift clicked it down to like a quarter of the size. You know how the, how the lines get. You know, yeah. you oh, twist yeah, yeah, yeah. and turn. But like, imagine like it's God. What is it like? Maybe a, a fifteen by fifteen, maybe. Oh, yeah. Like tiny, tiny little space with about forty of us. Huh? Put it somewhere. Oh. Uh, that's right here. We got we got crack this bad boy open. Sponsored by Jack Daniels. <laughs> oh, there you are, Nicholas. Nice yeah. of you to show up. Tell the story. Yeah, anyway, also thanks. Also missing legs. <laughs> <laughs> Broke your pretty armor, Nicholas. But, Break uh, your face. So no, we, you, after you go all the way through, and you saw some great graffiti on the walls, by the way, and I was sad, I didn't have the balls to, like, jot something myself, because, uh -huh. you know, in basic, you're, like, the, the drill sergeant's big brother. But eventually, I make my way all the way to the front, and they give you two big, actual, real-life live grenades. And you hold them close to your chest, yeah. like a newborn fucking baby. Like, you know, as if, like, paparazzi are going to try to steal your child in yeah. front of you for the to make it to TMZ. <laughs> and you go up to the instructor, you know, and they say, like, all right, go ahead and uh, release this part. And there's, like, two to three different safety mechanisms on the actual pineapple itself. Oh, wow. So, like, all right, go ahead and release this clip. All right, now go ahead and release this clip. Now get in your, uh, go get in your stance, pull, and throw. And, you know, you do that thing where <clears throat> uh, when you actually throw the grenade, it's kind of like, um, it's kind of like football where you throw that spiral obviously yeah. you don't twist your arm to make it a true spiral but what you do is you know you put it back and then you just throw oh, wow. and then with your left hand actually <laughs> look at all that yep. with your left hand you kind of aim yeah you know so you like move it out like with your knife hand and kind of face the horizon so after all that trouble after being such a monumental fuck up with my coloring book ACH I finally get up there the guy gives you know it's like alright go ahead and throw and I throw it and then I duck because, you know, I'm not an idiot. I eventually yeah. remember. And the best part is they must know how we think. Because when I go down, I'm like, oh, well, I guess I won't be able to see it. And there's a fucking viewing point uh. down below. And I watch the grenade go off. That's so cool. It's a, yeah, and it's, it's in the sand pit. 
and you just watch it's it's just it's just exactly like it looks in fucking Saving Private Ryan where just the sand just shoots up like there's a sandworm or something just boom it was glorious that's cool and because it's basic training we had to clean it up afterwards uh, yeah <laughs> yep I hope so you had fun up, now you yeah pick clean. up all the shrapnel and sweep the sand and pick up all the ash from the actual <laughs> grenade it's awesome it was so cool see everyone America's hero <clears throat> Basic was great, guys. There you go, your fragmentation grenade. Yes. And when, when you threw the gr uh, grenades, were they actual pineapple grenades, or were they, like, a different modification? Like, okay, so the way? pineapple is actually, like, a really old model. Mm -hmm. um, let me see what theirs in this game looks like. It it's, might it's actually be... Model. Oh, really? Yeah. It, it's, it's exactly like seeing the frag grenade. It's a frag grenade, like it says right there. See? Yeah. Ah, yeah, it did not look like that. Yeah, pull so the, the one I threw... Was, like, a cylinder, right? Uh, it was actually like a little ball. It was like a little oh, sphere. Oh, the pinball grenades. Okay. Yeah, it was a little, was a little sphere. Um, and it was it was labeled as such. And th that was one of the things they taught us in basic is the, are the different all the different grenade types like HE and smoke grenade, flashbangs. They're all color coded. They're all like you know it's basically yeah. dumbass proof. Yeah. So Oop, mine yeah. instead of instead of being like you know the the class that's for those who don't know that's why it's called the pineapple because of that texture. Which if you look at a real pineapple, it's pineapple. That's not really how it looks. But you know it's it's fine. Uh, yeah, don't this, hit the grenade. Yeah, this part really only has one safety, <laughs> just that one hook over here, just that one uh, handle. But mine had like three or four, so there's like a clip you push off with your thumb, and then there's another one, and then you actually pull the pin, and that's when it has to go. That's just loud as fuck. Yeah. We, we, yeah, we all had ear pro and all that. Yep. But no, that was by far one of the coolest parts. 